Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah and today we are continuing Tony's juice story. This is gonna be a very exciting episode because I built the juice store with, like I used up all of our money. Um, it's not completely done yet just because I ran out of money, but I'm still really excited to show you guys like the base store and kind of the vibe that I had in my mind. I really appreciate all of the suggestions in the comments. I really appreciate all the help in the comments. Like you guys know so much that I don't, so <laughs> it truly is a help. So thank you to everyone who has been helping me. So in this episode, I'm gonna show you guys the shop, of course, and then we're gonna try and get some employees and make the uniforms and uh, yeah, have our first like official, official day open because I feel like <laughs> in the last episode when we opened, it was kind of just a soft opening. We had like one, six pack with one missing and two customers so uh hopefully this goes it goes better this time also i asked you guys what you thought about freddy and so many of you guys are down so i'm really really excited about that i do think he's super super cute and i think that they would be perfect together um so we might go on a date with him today and see how that goes i hope you guys are excited for today's episode celsius of course cheers to you <sighs> let's get started <laughs> oh also Happy Father's Day to all the daddies out there and happy Father's Day to everyone's dad. All right guys, so this is the store. I know it's not much right now. I can only do so much with the money that we had, but you guys get the gist of it, right? <laughs> so uh, I made it like a pink and yellow and white theme. I wanted it to look modern and clean, but also very cute and eco-friendly if that makes any sense at all so basically we have i want to have like a little courtyard out here with a bunch of flowers and a bunch of plants and some more seating once we can afford it and then as you guys can see right here this is kind of like an open window type area so there's some restaurants near me where i live where it's like this they've just got like this big like garage door opening in their business and people can like sit along that window and like feel like they're outside but they're really inside and they can just like eat there at the tables so i wanted to incorporate that somehow so if you're wondering what that is <laughs> that's what that is so here's the uh front entrance i know it's very plain but like i said we need more money before we can make the store like super extravagant and you guys can already see what it kind of looks like on the inside which is really exciting i'm so excited to show you i hope you like it i was like nervous so basically you walk in and this is what you see. I wanted to incorporate fruitiness, like bright colors, but also like that like light wood that the Eco Lifestyle pack has a lot of. So you walk in and on these tables we'll have like random produce, I guess, from uh, whatever Tony has grown, whatever we have like extra of that we can just like sell. This box right here is uh, seltzers. I'm not really sure why they come in a box like that, <laughs> but those are seltzers. We've got some honey, some grapes, and then over here are some shelves where we can stock. In a perfect world, I would want this entire like shelving unit to be stocked with juices, but we didn't have enough at the moment, so I just put a few just to show you guys like the vision I had in my head, I guess. I love this light too. So we've got a little cooler here with more juice. We've got the cash register with some wax to be sold. I want to find like a bowl or like a tray or something that we can put all these loose items in, like the grapes and the wax and stuff. Um, that would be really cool. I'm not sure what that says, but I, in my head, I assume it says Tony's in Simlish. So that's what we're going to say that it says. <laughs> um, then we have this little like ladder shelf here where we have more honeys to sell. And then over here we've just got like this little area where people can sit and like drink their juice and a lot of you guys like the idea of having her shop be like a, a study spot so I will definitely add that trait to it so people hopefully people will like stay and just like sit and chill we'll see though I'm not really sure if you can do that with a retail spot but we'll see um, so yeah, this is like the seating area that I was telling you about people can sit and kind of just like look out at the city and see what's going on I think this view is just like You know, it's perfect. I would love to sit here and just hang out and have some juice This light though is everything against this wallpaper 
And then in this back corner, I just put a few coolers. I thought they looked, they suited the area. Um, we can put baked goods in there and I'm not really sure what goes in this one right here. Uh, I tried to drag some fruits, but that didn't work. I tried to drag some juice, but that didn't work. So I know that this one is for baked goods. I'm not really sure what that one's for, but we'll find out. Okay, and then back behind the cash register, we've got, excuse us, <laughs> we've got the door to the bathroom, which is for employees only, unfortunately. I don't want random sims coming in here and just like destroying it, but it's very basic, nothing crazy at the moment. And then through this door right here, we've got a little mini greenhouse, just so we can um, grow some things here and juice here. So it's all, ooh, a plane. <laughs> So yeah, it's all glass. I like this a lot. Uh, I forgot what I planted. I'm pretty sure I planted grapes, strawberries, some pomegranates, and I forget what those are, but yeah, it's something. And that is it. And then on the roof, it it's like flat, so we can add some stuff up here later if we want to. Like if we want to plant more plants, we can put them up here. Maybe like year-round plants so we don't have to have a shelter over them. But yeah, I really want to add more plants to the inside. I want to add more like art on the walls, which I think would be pretty cool. Um, and then out here, like I said before, I want to have like a courtyard. <sighs> and yeah, <laughs> I hope you guys like it. I hope it is a good start in your opinion. But let me just make sure we have that study spot tray because I can't remember if I added it or not. We didn't. Okay, let's do that then. Study spot. A great place to enhance one's mind in pursuit of higher education. Not only will sims complete their homework faster, but they can study longer without getting mentally exhausted. They'll also enjoy a slight bonus to all skill building. That's really cool. So let's do what we said we were gonna do and do some... Manage employees? I don't know. I don't really know what to do. How do you hire them? Oh, oh, okay. Select a sim below to hire. Oh, so you can't choose whoever you want? Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, well, oh wow. Look at the old school skill bars. It reminds me of The Sims 1. So basically it shows... What are these little icons mean? She's 40 an hour because... Why? I mean, you don't really need to be strong to work here, do you? <laughs> He's our friend as well. Do we want to do that? Do we want to hire friends? Is that like a conflict of interest? I remember Monique from our uni series. Maybe we should hire her. 40 an hour, I mean, that's like a lot, but maybe she'll be the best for what we need. Do you want to hire Monique Lake? I guess so. Um. Okay, what does that say? Tony has hired a new employee. Monique Lake will arrive for her first shift the next time the store is open. Be sure to track Monique's retail skills in the employee management window and assign her an appropriate work task when she arrives. <gasps> well, that's exciting, isn't it? Okay, what else do we need to do? Oh, right, uniforms. <laughs> Design uniforms. Design female uniform in Create a Sim. Oh my gosh, that is so fun. I don't even know, I don't know. Should, <sighs> okay, hold on, let me look through this stuff and see if there's something that tickles my fancy. <laughs> Maybe something like this. I'm trying to make it like something that would look good on all body types, obviously, and something that is comfortable and something that looks semi-professional, I guess? Uh. I don't know though. <laughs> this is hard. Something without like a pattern or a logo or anything like that. It's times like these where I wish I was streaming. <laughs> you guys have no idea. I love streaming so much. It's so fun. Maybe they can all wear that color block shirt that Tony always wears. Okay, yeah, here it is. Oh my gosh, what if we <laughs> what if we gave him like a um one of these like are these picnic baskets, I guess? To like walk around the store with and be like, oh, do you need a bag? Do you need a bag? Would that be weird? I think it's kind of a cute idea, but we have to test it first and see if it like just gets really awkward. And then I think maybe I'm leaning towards the button up more now that I'm like spending some time. Okay, I'm gonna go with this pink button up for now with the purple basket. 
If you guys have any ideas for uniforms, let me know in the comments, but I don't want to spend too much time because I know that if I let myself, I will be in there for like an hour. <laughs> okay, what else can we do? Purchase advertising. We have enough money to do that. Wait, insufficient business funds. Okay. If you guys are wondering where we got this money, I made some six packs and I, um, I sold them off camera just because I know that it can get boring. So I just did it off camera. Sign uniform, assign female uniform. Oh, why is there more than one? When we hire, hire a male, we can, um, make the, the male outfit. <laughs> Um, right, purchase advertising. Let's do a long-term television ad. Okay, can we purchase more than one? Oh, we can! A long-term web campaign. Uh. Okay, well, I guess we should open the store then. I'm nervous, but uh, let, let's get it. Open store. I'm scared. 9 a.m. <sighs> Fingers crossed. The store is open and customers are on their way to pursue Tony's merchandise! Hooray! Oh, there, there she is with her basket! Go girl! Get it girl! Even though it's like completely intersecting with her leg. Um... It's fine. Okay, so... Ooh, look at all the customers coming! Monique, where are you? Hold on, we need to assign you a task, right? Assign work task. Uh... Restock sold items. Answer customers' questions. And then we can be the one, one that rings up everybody. <gasps> We need music in here too, don't we? Just to put people in a good mood. Oh my god, Mortimer's so happy to see us. He's like, Tony, your store! It's amazing! I'm so happy for you! I remember when you were selling your juice on the side of your house. Congratulations! Thanks, everyone. Monique, do your job! Please! There you go! She's doing it! All right, and Tony can be in the back just making more juices while uh, Monique sits on her butt and does nothing. <laughs> Answer questions, please. It'll give me a notification, I think, when um, someone wants to buy something. So that's cool. Do your job. I guess we're gonna have to come out here and do what Monique doesn't. Mortimer, thanks for coming to the official grand opening of my store. I don't know what these little bars are. Is that like customer relationship or something? If it is, I assume we want that to be like, hi, <laughs> right? <laughs> Yay! Tony, look at how many people are here! I'm so proud. I kind of wish people would just like come in and purchase though, instead of just like stand around. Dag dag. I don't know what I want to put here either, or here, but there are little these little like indents in the wall that are just begging for like some shelves or some decor. This girl, manage. Um, Monique is currently, is not currently slacking. I beg to differ, but okay. All right, everyone is still just standing around. Is this how it's gonna be? What a choice, what choice of value I'm, ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, 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 ring you up, ring up customer. Come on, Tony, ring her up. No! Oh my God, she didn't get there in time. Oh my God, now she's leaving with the hand. Shoot. Oh my God, stop flirting with Monique. What the heck? That is your employee. This isn't, I don't like this. It's just like a bunch of Sims come in. They stand around, talk for days. They don't buy anything. They don't hang out like at the tables and drink their juices. Oh my gosh, she's buying a six pack, thank god. Hey boss, you've kept me working in overtime on this shift. I need to head home in compliance with the Fair Labor Sim Act. Okay, see you later. Yes, 1,126. It's not the best, but um, like we can sell them for more at the table. Uh, is it even worth it having this store? Well, we've been open for like nine hours, so people better be buying stuff. 700 for that for that for that seltzer and then he's buying a six pack from the cooler oh my god yes so proud of you tony babes look at her look at her oh my god this little bean is so cute <laughs> look at her ew what's up with the party in the bathroom i need to lock that bathroom 
it was supposed to be just for employees, but everyone was like almost peeing their pants. All right, I think maybe we should close the store because we've been open for almost 24 hours and that's pretty insane. Well, who's this? recognize you. Talia S Simmons? Simons? I think that's one of your guys' sims. She's adorable. Alright, I think it's time to close. Poor Tony here is exhausted, so... Dang it. Minus 360? Was that for our employee, I'm guessing? Oh, we made a decent amount of money today. That's what's up. I'm proud of you, Tony. And we got some perk points, so let's see what we can buy, shall we? Let's see, my first simoleon unlocks a decorative wall object that celebrates the store's initial success. Check the retail items section of build mode. That would be cute. Proactive pedestal, unlocks a new pedestal. Stunning sign, unlocks a new sign. <gasps> Look at this perk, you guys. Customers will have a greater desire to purchase an item when they first enter the store. Okay, I get it now. So when you first open your business, it's really slow and uh, not really what you imagine, but once you get all these perks, that's when things start going really, really smoothly. Okay, well, I'm thinking maybe we should just save our points for Serious Shopper, because I hate the way that Sims come in and just linger, like, that is like super annoying, so <laughs> we're gonna save our points for now. Oh, and she's passing out. Okay, goodbye everyone. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you, thank you. It's a Sunday, so maybe Tony can go home and then we can rest it off and have a nice date night tonight perhaps with Freddy. This is very exciting, guys. I can't believe we already have our business. It's gonna be a pop in business soon. Mark my words. Ah, home sweet home. Okay, so the other day when I was making the juice store, what the? Oh, that's so annoying. Why do they have to regrow if they're sheltered? Oh my God, whatever. Anyway, when I was building the juice store, I hovered over our plants to see how they were doing. And it said that all of my plants were in perfect condition. And now that I'm doing it, they're back down to what they were before. I don't know if it was a glitch or something, but I got really excited and I was like, wow, these bees are so overpowered. That is ridiculous. Like why have I never used bees before? Because I thought that they made the plants like perfect in that short amount of time, but no, I was wrong. I think it was just a glitch, which is quite sad, but it is what it is. Tony, what are you doing? You are a mess right now. Let's get those needs sorted, shall we? Darling, please just take a shower really quick. Okay, she's like way too tired to even have a shower. She keeps getting out of the shower and passing out. So I guess bedtime it is for a little bit. What? Excuse me, Tina? That is so mean. We haven't talked to you in days. Why would we be obsessed with you? Hopefully that that's like an inside joke between them. I'm just gonna say that that's what it is because that was really mean. All planting efforts for green initiatives and con conifer station have been completed, residents. Enjoy your greener, fresher neighborhood. You've earned it. Uh, if I'm being honest, I don't see a difference. Oh my gosh, you guys, I forgot. <gasps> we now have the uh, community garden. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. We gotta check that out soon. Tony's so sad from that text. I don't blame you, babe. That was really mean. One of you guys said to eat honey, and apparently that really helps your hunger, so we're gonna give that a shot. So dark. How are the bees doing? Look at that freaking relationship bar. It's full. Collect honey, collect beeswax. Oh, and you guys were saying that if you have a high enough relationship with the bees, you can collect the swarm and have them do things for you? which I think is pretty sick. So I think we're gonna give that a shot. Oh my gosh, it's already 9.30. Okay, perhaps we should go on a date tomorrow then. Okay, let's see, collect swarm. And then they go in your inventory. Okay, and what can you do? Woo? Oh wow, that's really cool. Okay, I'm, I'm guessing that makes like that person like you. 
Pollinate nearby plants. Cheer. Oh my god, you can send it to cheer up someone. That's so sweet. Cheer up self with bees. Attack. Oh. <gasps> send to fetch gift. Okay, we're doing that. I, I, I'm interested. Go, bees, go! Find us a gift, please. <gasps> What'd we get? Oh, one goth boy. It's a My Sims trophy. <laughs> that's so cute. Oh my god, it's a rare one, too. Okay, that's pretty dope. Let's put it in our storage box. <laughs> Cute. What do we have in here? Trash pile, right. Those are gonna be recycled. Uh, where did our bees go? Did they go back in their box? Another day, another dollar. She's always up at the freaking crack of dawn. I wish I was that motivated. Oh, and you guys said that we can make trash juice. <laughs> Isn't that disgusting? Who would want that? But then again, someone did buy a spoiled, um, six pack from us oh yeah and you guys in the comments one of you said um that you sold dirty dishes on the yard sale table and someone bought them <laughs> that is so funny like that is for sure desperate for money huh selling dirty dishes holy cannoli okay let's see what happens if we collect the swarm and send them to woo freddy let's see what how come it's not showing up? Sad day. Let's get him to send uh, get another gift. A Bridgeport postcard. <laughs> Why do we always get Bridgeport postcards? It's the exact same one too. I'm gonna get her to die for some deals and die for meals since we have um we've been putting trash in the Oh my god, look at how filthy that is. Ooh, a mail. Thanks, mail lady. $250, not horrible. What do we find? Some recycled materials. Okay. Uh, ooh, another frog. Don't judge us for dumpster diving. Eco upgrade part. What else we got? Uh, hound's tooth dye. Uh, brick red dye. Oh, that's dope. Keep diving for deals until you can't dive anymore, okay? Canary yellow dye. Uh, another bed. <laughs> How come this has dumpsters infinite deals? Uh, plink shower. Nice. More recycled materials. $30. Uh, traditional dining table. I just made a bet and the loser had to give you money. Don't waste it. Oh, shoot. Thanks, Tony. Oh my gosh, a computer. No way. $3. An eco upgrade part. Why does this dumpster have infinite deals, you guys? What is happening? Seven dollars. Okay, now it's done. All right. Uh, go ahead and sing in the shower. <laughs> La di da di da. I think it's so funny how Sims sometimes they uh, shower in CC, like the most random CC ever, too. Like, why? We got so much stuff. How exciting. I think I'm gonna put all of our upgrade parts into our storage box because we just don't need them right now, you know? Oh, and we got another frog. Let's add it to the collection. <laughs> here we go. The gang's all here, guys. Frog one, frog two, mosquitoes. I'm happy with our collection. What are you sad about? I don't want it from money text. Let's make some trash juice, like I said we were going to. I'm very curious. Very, very curious. How much is it gonna be? 44. Okay. Apply mite treatment. Bond with them. Oh, I forgot we were part of the garden gnomes. Whoops. I haven't been to a meeting in forever. Okay, what is this? It bubbles very suspiciously. Is it safe to drink? Would you like to name the monstrosity you've created? Yeah, trash. <laughs> oh my god, what does it look like? <gasps> oh my god. Look at that. That's honestly really cool. Look at the cool bottles it comes in. <gasps> okay, I kind of want her to drink one. I really want to see... Self-sufficiency receive the most votes. Okay, whatever. I don't care about that. Um, I want to see what kind of moodlet it gives her. Oh my god, she's straight up drinking poison, isn't she? <gasps> she's crying while she drinks it. Come on, quickly finish it. Oh no! 
Oh no, oh no, oh no. Horribly fizzy. There's something unsettling in this fizz. Not sure which end it will come out. <gasps> I thought maybe that it would like give you a positive moodlet just to like throw you off a little bit, but nah, it's all bad. It's rebate day. Should we buy something? Should we buy some things? Should we spruce up our front yard a little bit? Tony's sleep schedule is so messed up. That's probably why she always wakes up super, super early. She's really honey, so I'm, she's really honey. <laughs> she's really hungry, so I'm gonna get her to eat some honey. Wow, look at how much that fills up her hunger bar. <gasps> you weren't lying, honey is amazing. Let's dive for some more deals this morning. Some more recycled materials. Okay, well let's go into um, build and buy mode or buy mode, whatever you call it. And let's sell everything that we found. Why is there a six pack in here? No, that needs to be in her inventory. Oh, we have a fruit slice mat. Hmm, that can stay. Oh, this must be from our business inventory as well. Okay, so this is burnt, so I'm gonna sell that. This, oh my God, look at how cute it is. It's probably just broken. Hmm. We can keep it in our inventory then. I don't want this. And then this... It's in perfect condition. 12,500. <gasps> how are we getting so freaking lucky with this? Seriously, how? This definitely wouldn't be the first computer I'd buy. So maybe we should just sell it. Yes. Oh, $16,000. Holy cannoli, am I right? Oh my god, we're getting so lucky. Seriously. The sim gods are on our side. Uh, for her aspiration, she wants to graft onto three plants. Um, interesting. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys I planted some lilies over here. How do you graft? Ooh, ready to evolve. What about this one? No, almost there. You guys are almost there. Ooh, the lilies are ready to harvest. Maybe we should try fertilizing them with the apples. All right, well, we'll see what that does. Uh, let's collect this juice and then we'll head over and see what the community garden looks like. Soy milk. Soy milk. Actually, what did we call this again? Tony's soy milk, I think. Uh, let's head on over here and see what plants they've got. I swear, if there aren't any, if people aren't planting stuff, then I just, I don't see the point. Feels good to be back! We haven't been here in a while. Let's have a little tour, shall we? So you come in, you got the community board. Come around here, you got a little picnic table, which is really, really cute. Over here, you've got a place where you can farm bugaroonies, which is cool. And then over here... Oh, hey, there's that grill again. Uh, I'm guessing this is where the garden is. I don't see any plants currently, which is lame. We got some vertical, vertical gardens over there. Is she gonna plant something? Oh, okay. So it seems like you have to actually come to the space. <gasps> yes, you have to actually come here for people to plant things. Okay, cool. There's Moira from the Garden Gnomes. That's what's up. Alright, you come around here. Oh my god, oh my god, the girl's pregnant! Oh, oh, it better not be Freddy's. I saw Freddy eyeballing you. It better not be his. I swear if it's his, I'm gonna... F I'm gonna blow my lid, I swear. Um, we just got some, like, decoration type stuff over here. A bathroom as usual, the lockers as usual. And then, is there something upstairs? Is it just a seating area still? Okay, yeah, just more gardening things that do collect or some solar panels. Nice, nice, I really like this lot. It's really cute. So what do we- What happens? Who's fu is it Talia and- Oh my gosh, Tony, were you involved in that? See what's happening, okay, you weren't. Why- Why did someone put a vanilla ice cream in the planter? Can you plant vanilla- 
you can't even plant it. Someone just put it there. Um, maybe we should eat it. It's normal quality. Oh my god, she just aged up right before our eyes. Happy birthday, Katrina. Congratulations. No one's even wishing you happy birthday. Um, let's give her something. I want to give her some honey. Hold on, where's give gift? Give gift, friendly gift. Um, honey, happy birthday, Katrina. I saw you age up and I just wanted to say happy birthday. Do you like it? Yeah, she likes it. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so we got some bluebells, got grapes, basil. Mmm, I'd be down for some basil soda. What's this right here? Faux meat cube. Why are people putting non plants in the planters? Put away. What's this here? Spinach. Okay, cool. And then some people are basil, spinach. Oh my god, they're fighting again. I don't think they like each other. Or they're like dating and they're just like having some public drama. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Put, oh, put the meat cube away. Stop putting ice cream in the freaking planters. We're stealing it. I, I don't understand why people keep doing that. Oh my god, they're fighting again. You guys should like take that elsewhere. Ooh, mushrooms. Again? You y'all need to work out your issues. Please. Let's buy a farmer flowers and fruit packet. Uh farmer veggies and herbs and another uncommon plants packet. And let's just see what we got. Hopefully it's not a bunch of repeats, but we'll see. Okay. Uh green peas, bell pepper. Basil, spinach, and parsley. Okay, well, excuse me. Let's plant a bell pepper. Let's plant a green pea. Okay, see you guys? I knew I wasn't tripping. Magnificent quality soybeans, but my plant is no longer magnificent, so I don't, I don't understand. What is this? Another freaking meat cube. Dude. Another ice cream. Is anyone else having this problem with their freaking community garden? That literally that makes no sense to me. Oh, what are you guys planting up here? Hold the phone. Onions. Bluebells. More spinach. I wish people would plant some exotic stuff. Is there a recycler machine here? I don't think there is. Ah, that's lame. I want one. Okay, let's just uh, pop one back here for people to use. And then... What else do we need? Ah, dumpster. ba -dum Perfection! Perfection! Okay, now we can recycle all this trash that we've been collecting in our inventory. Um, oh my gosh, we can re recycle so many things. Okay, recycle all the trash piles. You know what would also be cool to have in this little area? A grill. Cool. Since we're hungry, why don't we grill up some stuff for everybody? Let's have... Let's make some baked potatoes. We've got all the money that we need right now, so I'm very, very, very happy. We don't even have to worry about it. <gasps> Call to meal. Come on, everyone. I made some baked potatoes. Let's eat. Valerian plant. That's cool. Something different. Another freaking ice cream, which we are taking. And a black bean bush. That's so cool. You know what's another thing that I wanted to do? I think... Oh my god, I just had the best idea ever. Okay. All right. We are going to go home. And we're going to invite Freddy camping. And while we're camping, we are going to see if there's any... Special plants in Granite Falls. I think that's what it's called, right? Granite Falls that we can Harvest and bring home and make juice out of so it can be like a work trip, but also a social trip at the same time I know I know I'm brilliant <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm far from brilliant, but it is a good idea. Okay, so let's take care of the needs that she needs to take care of find her a cute camping outfit and then invite him 
invite him out to go. I'm excited. All right, guys, here is her camping outfit. We are all ready to go. I'm pretty excited. Uh, I think I've only camped in The Sims one time and I don't really remember it very well. Should we invite a few Sims or should it just be me and Freddy? Perhaps we should invite Tina and her wife too, just so it's not like <gasps> super awkward, just us two, because we've, bar we've barely been on one date and that's it. Maybe Freddy and Tony are friends, so we can invite Tony as well, just so it's not super awkward for Freddy. And then we need a friend as well, so it can be like us two and then them two type of thing. Hmm. I would invite Tina, but then I would feel weird not inviting Yasmin or Olive. Is there another girl that we're kind of close with? Let's invite Talia. I like her. And she has like a really cute look and she's already all CC'd out, so that's easy enough. Okay, so we got Talia, another Tony, and Freddy, and we're going camping. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. What's this? Sims cannot go on vacation on non-rental lots. One bedroom, one bedroom, two bedroom, four bedroom. Oh, and this is a campground. Hmm. I think it would be more fun on a campground, don't you guys think? This is like a house. Yeah, let's go to the campground. Rent for... Let's do two days, and if we want to come home early, we can. I don't know, are there tents on the campground? Or do we have to buy our own? Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything. But first things first, I wanna give Tony a proper makeover because we haven't done that yet. It's Sherelle, huh? It's Sherelle. Okay, let's have a look at you, shall we? Let's take off your accessories. You are very, 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 very Maxis, aren't you? So you've got like big blocky brown brows. Holy cannoli. Oh, those are pretty good. Okay. And then your beard. I think we're gonna have to keep it because I don't have a CC like full beard yet. I only have like shorter ones. Oh my God, he looks so funny without his beard. Oh my God, make it stop. Turn it off. <laughs> it was this beard. Okay, well that works for now. Okay, there, that's better. Oh, a serial romantic, chopstick savvy, neat, and English tranquility. Okay, so he's into fishing too. I, I would assume that's why Tony and Freddy are friends. See? It's all lining up. <laughs> you guys <laughs> thought it was so funny that I asked if you can make fish juice, but like, I feel like that's... It's a, it's a good question. What if you can make fish juice? That would be so dope. Uh, let's put you in this. It's more outdoorsy for sure. Oh, you poor thing. You got beat up. Holy cannoli. All right, let's have a look. There are no tents, a bonfire, a grill, and a horseshoe pit. Okay, what do we do about tents then? Ooh, ooh, here's something. Ah, would you look at that? 1070 for a tent. I'm good on that. We just need something simple. Okay, let's get two of these. We'll get two tents, because I doubt the people we came with are gonna buy a tent for themselves. And then a cooler. Look, someone already grilled some burgers! Okay, let's grab one. Okay. Oh my god, he's talking about woohooing. <gasps> Well, it's good to see that they're getting along. That that's kind of what I wanted. It's kind of like a, a setup, you know? Okay, here's tent one. And then we can put tent two over here, I guess. Kind of like in its own area away from the other tent. Dude, this girl. Oh my God, I think she's maybe mean. Okay, here's the cooler. And then we've got two of these things there we go what is she doing oh my god i don't think she's a good very good sim i really want to know her traits now oh no buggies 
Oh my gosh, they're all sitting. What the? That girl is so mean. That was the wrong person to invite, wasn't it? This is vibes. I want to go camping now. Should we put some juice on the table for everyone? Okay, let's put this one out. Grab them if you like. I wish we could put them in the cooler. That'd be cool. Tell group story. A ghost story about vampires with everybody. All right, Tony, let's hear it. <gasps> Guys, I'm getting scared. Look at her go. Oh, they're clapping. That was so cute. Oh my god, I love that. <gasps> Wait, are there actual ghosts now that she told a ghost story? Or are they just for- Oh my god, there is an actual ghost. That's so funny. Let's scare Freddy. He's seen a ghost just now and she's like, Hey, guess what? Boom! <laughs> Listen to Freddy's deep secret. Oh my god, cute. They are so cute together. Cute. Cute, 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 cute. Okay, what's going on now? Is he going to sleep? No, don't go to sleep with Tony. Well, <laughs> how's your mood, Tony? It's actually pretty good. Maybe we should go exploring. Try to, like, find some plants since Freddy went to sleep. Oh, 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 okay, let's go to the national park, see what's up. Harvest unidentified fruit. <gasps> Harvest all. Locust? Oh, this is exciting. We we get to add more to our bug collection. Looks like that's all to harvest right now. Okay, but what is it though? Unidentified fruit, what could this be? Attempt to identify? Oh, hi, we know you. Oh, she's gonna stargaze, that's cute. Uh, Tony has no idea what the plant is. Building herbalism skill will help identify plants. Oh my god, okay. A rainbow firefly? You guys, this is fun. This is so fun. Well, I think that's probably it for now. I think she's going back to lodging, which is good. She's so tired. These two have been talking this whole time we've been sleeping. I have no idea where Freddy is. But it's snowing. What the heck? Oh my god, rain? Snow and then rain, that's some crap luck. Okay, I'm gonna convince Tony to date that girl. Hook up with Talia. See what he says. I don't know, Talia, you're not very convincing. Oh my god, yeah, she's probably like super mean. This camping trip is a big old bust, isn't it? There's really no point in being here. It's just gonna be raining and lightning the whole time. How do we go home early? Ah, oh, here we go, travel home. Okay, well, that was not what I expected or pictured, but at least we got some fruits. That was like the main reason we went. And to like spend some more time with Tony a little bit, even though they have absolutely no romance bar. <laughs> oh man, home sweet home. Okay, let's have some honey. We got so many bugs. Oh my god, look at all the mosquitoes. I'm gonna sell the mosquitoes since we already have one. Rainbow firefly. That's so pretty. And then we've got some dragonflies and some locusts. Look at how pretty they are. The locusts not so much, but the fireflies definitely. And then these are dragonflies. Okay. We can put the ice creams that were left at the community lot in our fridge. That's perfect. Fossilized udder? Ew! <laughs> That's disgusting. Yes, I want to sell it. Let's sell these bugs as well. Okay, let's go to our store and sell all the six packs that we have right now. All right, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and open the store for a little while. Uh, I might forward through this since it can be really repetitive and annoying. <laughs> oh, and it's Harvest Fest. Oh my god, there's gnomes on the lot. But why though? How are the plants doing here anyway? Oh. They're all ready to harvest. 
What are these again? Oh yeah, blackberry and then a lemon tree and some grapes. Okay, right. I'm gonna try and appease the gnomes. Wow, a kid really made a mess in our store. I had her make some basil kombucha. Bomb. I don't like kombucha, but I love basil. Like, I- lately, I've been eating basil every freaking day. With tomatoes. Mmm. Ooh, ooh, what do we get? Seasonal spring plants. <gasps> oh my gosh, look! It was- it's identified in our inventory, but when we load it here, it tells you what it is. Huckleberry, muckleberry, Ah, uh, and that's it. That's all we got. Oh my god, yes. I'm gonna make some huckleberry juice. How cute! Can you get out from behind the register, please? You're not allowed. Girl, get off your phone! <gasps> oh, the kombucha only sold for $3.50. That's nothing. Let's see what we got in the spring plants packet. Carrots! Cute! Oh my god, Freddy's calling us. So this is going to sound crazy. I know we're friends and all, but well, okay, here it goes. <gasps> I have a crush on you! Okay, it's out there. Um, so would you want to go out with me sometime? You're super cool. I really want to hang out with you more. You guys, this is so perfect! How- oh my god, this- I just love it when things just line up perfectly. The game, like, wants us to do what we want without us actually having to do it. Oh my god, this is amazing. And this text is so cute. I feel like it's totally something Freddy would text her to. Just really shy and cute. Oh my god. Of course, let's go on a date. Wow, really? That's so awesome. Oh, I'm so happy I worked up the courage to ask. Let me know what works for you and we'll go out. Tony! Oh my god, why are you not more happy? Oh my god, so cute. I love this game. Okay, what do we get here? Seasonal spring plants, seasonal winter plants. Max sales skill! Monique is truly remarkable at sales. She's now ringing up customers as fast as fast can be and is nearly always successful when interacting with shoppers. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, overtime again. Okay, well you're free to go. Whenever you'd like. It's fizzy juice. That's weird. This was the huckleberry one. I wonder why it's like not registering. Whoa! 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 Okay, um, let's set this for sale. Okay, I'm gonna get Tony a moodlet solver because she keeps passing out. Uh, let me just take care of that for you real quick, okay, love? Oh yeah, and I wanted to get her the marketable trait because I think that if it updated with this pack, I think that it will make her juices worth more. Let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Hopefully they updated it. 1,500? Absolutely. Definitely. That's cheap. So it's like a trait now, right? Let me see. Yeah, it is. Okay, what's this? Oh, that's so cool. Recovering from being over butchered faster. I didn't know this was like an actual trait. That's so funny. Someone buy the six pack. I might as well set these gnomes for sale, am I right? <laughs> I think she's gonna buy one, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous to see how much it is. 5,850. I think that's the most we've ever sold a six pack for before. Holy cannoli. Okay, let's close. Oh my god, we were open for 34 hours and we only made 11,436. <laughs> oh man. Oh my gosh, here's Lena again. We can finally introduce ourselves properly. Hi, Lena. She's so cute. All right, well, let's go home. And what time is it? Four o'clock on a Friday? Maybe we can um, end the episode by going out on a little date with Freddy. Oh, look, that little taxi center gave them some romance bar. That's exciting. All right, where should we go? Let's see what I put in Newcrest. Did I put anything? Not yet. Shoot, that was my other LP. Oh my god, I don't think I placed any restaurants. Okay. Um, maybe we should just cook for him then? That could be fun. Can you stop eating the cereal? All right, let's cook. Hmm. What's a good date food? Spaghetti, maybe? That could be cute. 
All right, spaghetti is done. Why don't you come, or actually, wait till he gets here first to come upstairs and make some drinks. All right, we made Freddy some wine. There you go. And we made ourselves some sparkling water. Okay, call to meal. Let's eat, Freddy. Let's eat. There you go. Even though we're all done. Oh my god. They can already have their first kiss. Stop! Stop with the death jokes! Aww! Why are you laughing? Thanks for coming, Freddy. See you soon? Yes, yeah, see you soon. Okay, go to bed. I know you're miserable. No one drank the wine. Let's open these seed packets that we got as well. Oh! Tomato! Cute! And Christmas rose. Love those. Okay, that was it. Also, she wants to graph three times for her aspirations, so I'm gonna get her to do that. Because we did take some cuttings while we were in Granite Falls. Oh my god! Look! They're perfect again! I don't really understand why it does that. And then when I leave the game, these lilies that I just planted are perfect quality now. I don't get it. You guys are gonna have to tell me what the heck is- what that is about, cause, um, yeah, that's really weird. Ha! <laughs> she just busted out this wine. She's like, you know what? I'ma celebrate. I'ma have this glass of wine. <laughs> Good for you, girl. Good for you. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to leave this part right here. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the store. Please let me know if you have any more suggestions or let me know what you want to happen in this Let's Play. I love you so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!